earthquakes. In this module, you will learn about earthquakes. It is Sunday morning. Neil is chatting with his uncle. What is happening? Why is everything moving? Neil, it's an earthquake. Come, let's hurry outside. Kids, have you ever experienced or heard about an earthquake? Do you wonder what it is? Come, let us find out. The outermost layer of our earth is the earth's crust. It is made up of different layers of big and small rocks. These layers of rock are called plates. These plates continuously move and while moving, they slide past one another or bump into each other. We often do not feel these plates moving because the movement is negligible. But sometimes, the plates crash together or they pull apart or move over each other. When this happens, a lot of energy releases. This energy moves outwards and reaches the Earth's surface. As this enormous energy reaches the Earth's surface, it shakes the ground and anything present on it. This shaking or the sudden shock of the Earth's surface is what we call an earthquake. The point in the Earth's crust deep below the Earth's surface at which an earthquake begins is called a focus. The point directly above the focus on the surface of the Earth is called the epicenter. Sometimes the earthquakes are strong while sometimes they are weak. There is a special instrument that is used to measure the strength of an earthquake. This instrument is known as seismograph. The magnitude of the earthquake is measured on the Richter scale. Strong earthquakes cause a lot of damage to buildings, roads, dams, bridges. People and animals often get trapped or crushed under buildings and fallen trees. So, earthquakes can have severe effect on the lives of people. Hence, it is important to take safety measures during an earthquake. Let us learn about some of the ways of staying safe during earthquakes. If you are indoors during the earthquake, the first thing you should try to do is to move out. In case you cannot do this, then move away from heavy objects and glass objects that may fall down and injure you. When you are outdoors, step in the open grounds. Look out for electric poles and huge trees and stay away from them. An earthquake also occurs under the sea. Such an earthquake gives rise to huge water waves. These waves are called a tsunami. A tsunami causes equal damage in coastal places. Let's recap. Earthquakes are the shaking or the sudden shock of the Earth's surface in which the ground and anything present on it shake vigorously. Earthquake is measured on the Richter scale by an instrument called seismograph. Earthquake causes a lot of damage to lives and property. We should take all the possible measures to keep ourselves protected during an earthquake. Tsunami is an earthquake that occurs under the sea.